Hey guys, this week's lick is just a blues lick that's actually from a Phil Keggy song. I just liked the lick, I thought it was a pretty cool blues lick, so I thought I'd figure it out and share it with you guys. It's based, it's an A minor, or like an A blues, I guess you would say, and it's based off of just a regular A minor pentatonic scale, six string root note, and the shape right below that, that A minor pentatonic scale. Those two, there's some cool bending stuff also, and of course I will supply the tab for you right below, but come take a closer look. I'll show you exactly how I'm playing. So we're in kind of an A blues, and we're going to be using A minor pentatonic. Six string root note, fifth fret. And the first note is just a full bend with your pinky on the eighth fret of the B string. With a lot of vibrato on it, really wide vibrato. And then you're going to go up to the A note on the fifth fret with your index finger and work your way down the scale. All the way down to the seventh fret of the A string with your third finger. So you have the bend, then walk down the scale, and then you're gonna come to the fifth fret G string with your index finger and give it kind of a quarter bend, not a half step bend, but a quarter bend, and then grab the A with your third finger on the seventh fret of the D string. And that's kind of the midway point to the to the lick, so the second half of the lick starts off on the minor printing tonic scale that's one shape below the one we just talked about. And you're gonna start off on the A note on the second fret of the G string with your index finger. Hammer on to the fifth fret with your pinky and then pull off back to where your index finger was and then just work your way down that scale fifth fret with your pinky on the D string index finger second fret pull off to that and go to your pinky on the fifth fret again on the next string over the A string and then pull that off to the third fret with your middle finger do the same thing on the next string, 5th fret with your pinky, pull it off to the 5th, 3rd fret with your middle finger. And then once you get there, that's kind of the end of the shape. Then pull off to an open E, and then you're going to come to finish the lick off as a little 3rd fret action on the A string with your middle finger, bend that up a quarter step and finish off with an A note on the 5th fret of the low E string. So that whole second part, or second phrase of the lick is this slowly. So that's kind of a good practice on shifting from one pentatonic scale shape to the next down, so... Shift. It's a Phil Keggy lick, but it sounds like something Eric Johnson or Joe Bonamassa would do too. So take this, uh, experiment around with this once you learn it, and come up with your own licks that kind of shift in between those two shapes.